Hello guys, welcome back to Engineer Tyna Academy, and on today's video, we shall look at plaster and the quantity of cement and sand required for plastering a wall. Plaster is a crucial in any construction as it gives a smooth and even finish to walls. Now let's consider a wall to be plastered to be of area, 10 meters by 10 meters, that is 10 meters length and 10 meters width giving us an area of 100 square meters, and the thickness of plaster is 12 millimeters. Now the volume of plaster required is area of plaster multiplied by the thickness of plaster, that is 100 multiplied by 0.012, which equals to 1.2 cubic meters. And that is what volume of mortar, which consists of cement, sand, and water. For us, to get the quantity of cement and sand, we need to get the dry volume. Therefore the dry volume will be the wet volume multiplied by factor of 1.35, that is 1.2 multiplied by 1.35, which equals to 1.62 cubic meters. Now the mix ratio for the mortar is 1 is to 4, that is which gives us a total ratio of 5. The volume of cement therefore will be the ratio of cement divided by total ratio multiplied by the dry volume. That is 1 which is the ratio of cement divide 5, then multiplied by 1.62, which is the dry volume which equals to 0.324 cubic meters. Let us now calculate the volume of sand, which will be ratio of sand divide by the total ratio multiplied by the dry volume that is 4 divide by 5 multiplied by 1.62, which equals to 1.296 cubic meters. Therefore, the number of cement bags required will be volume of cement divide by volume of one bag of cement. A bag of cement is sold in 50 kilograms bag and the volume of each bag is 0.035 cubic meters. Therefore, the number of bags of cement required is 0.324 divided by 0.035, which equals to 9.25 bags, hence the number of bags required is 10 bags. 